Hey everybody, we're here to talk about all the rogue cards that were revealed for Whizbang's workshop that's coming out in little, like, two weeks, not even two weeks. I'm very excited about this. I'm looking at all of the classes in uh, one specific video, all the cards from the classes in one specific video. And don't forget, I have a giveaway going on for a chance to get um, the expansion. All you have to do is like, comment the video that I'm linking all over the place, you'll see it and enter in the chance for that giveaway. So the war, uh, the rogue cards, excuse me, I just did a uh, warlock set and I'm not too sure where this is gonna go, but I'm looking at the rogue cards right now and I know where the rogue cards is gonna go. They're gonna go to your face. A lot of times this is dealing with rogue pirates or pirate rogue, whatever you wanna call it. It's just a lot of busted nutty rogue cards. And the first one is um, Shoplifter Goldbeard. It's a six mana five five pirate, and it's after you summon a pirate, summon a copy of it that attacks a random enemy, then dies. This one's just nutty. You've got one mana pirates. You've got two mana pirates. Look at this. Look at the options that we have here. We have Dread Corsair that that's a taunt, um, cost one less. So the possibility if you have a weapon, you'll be able to play this very easily. You have this one, gain attack equal to the attack of your weapon. You can use this. It'll be possibly heavy. Um, you've got this one has charge. We have a weapon equipped. There's just so many options where you'll be able to play this pretty quickly. And you know how Rogue likes to do things. They like to do things to where everything that they have is is lower cost than what you normally see and so i would absolutely think that there'll be some mana cheating going on as well this card looks broken and it also looks super fun and the art is amazing so next up is sonya water dancer four mana three three after you play a one cost card get a copy of it that costs zero let's look at the signature card because these signature cards this expansion is amazing i cannot wait to uh spend my mortgage payments on these signature cards i'm gonna do it um, my wife won't watch these videos she'll be fine um, it's really cool looking card um, they were saying that there's some synergies here that we're probably not a hundred percent seeing but um, some of the festival of legends cards for rogue that weren't really popular I'll let you guys guess which ones they are might have some opportunity here they might be coming back and we'll make this card even more broken this should be fun it should be exciting to see um, eight mana, everything must go. Summon two random four cost minions. Cost one less for each card you've drawn this turn. This one's broken as well. Um, I'm excited to see what happens with this uh, card. And this card looks like it's going to be broken like the rest of them. Let's keep on going. Um, four mana water cannon. And it's a 3-3 three, three weapon after your hero attacks. Summon a 1-1 one, one pirate that attacks a random enemy oh, this is nuts uh yeah water slider look at the, the art is amazing it's a pirate we already know it's a pirate the art is so cute um yeah this is a broken weapon this is going to be a nutty combo that we're seeing with rogues and pirates i'm excited to be doing this i don't play a lot of rogue but i might change my mind with this i love the um the, you know the archetypes to where it's just one type of uh tribe or what have you so this is cool i'm down with it uh five mana four three pirate sandbox scoundrel miniaturize and the battle cry is your next card this turn costs three less so now we know how these these like i said there's going to be some sort of mana cheat going on here it is and look at the mini one look it's a sandbox scoundrel it's a little baby one um it's a one one it's a pirate, and the mini battle cry is your next card this turn costs one less. Mana cheat out the wazoo. That's a lot. Um, this is cool. The next one up, location, three mana, three charges, crystal cove. The next minion you summon this turn has its stats set to four, four. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be broken. This is going to be broken. I'm kind of excited for this. There's there's really cool things. I'm hoping that this pops off as much as it looks like it's going to pop off. Um, next up, Dig for Treasure. And it's a one mana uh, draw a minion. If it's a pirate, get a coin. You'd be silly not to run your entire deck full of um, minions. And there'd be pirates. It makes sense. This one's this one's pretty cool. And look, it's kind of mana cheat. Anyway, we've talked about this. This is going to be nutty. Um, three mana, three two pirate bargain bin buccaneer. 
Love the yard on it. It's a rush. And the combo is summon a copy of this. So what's better than one of these dudes? Two of these dudes. Um, yeah, pirate's going to be fun. Next up, two mana thistle T set. Discover a spell from another class. Get a copy of it. I'm not a fan of the, the, the rogue archetype that's, you know, pulling other classes or, or pulling other cards from classes and just, just randomizing everything. So I like the art of this and this art is really cool, but I'm not really a fan of this card. That doesn't mean it's not going to be broken. Rogue looks like it's getting a heck of a good expansion. Um, do we have a last one? Yes, we do. Toy Boat, last one. Two mana, two, three. After you summon a pirate, draw a card. So this is a great way to get some card draw if you even need card draw. I don't know if we need card draw. This is a really cool looking um, piece of art on the card. And yeah, I, I think this one's gonna be strong as well. Rogue definitely got some good cards for Whizbang's workshop. So that's it. Like I said, look out for the giveaway. Look out, I'm doing a class conversation for each one of the classes when all of the cards are released. I've already done a bunch of them. There's more coming and I will see you all in the next video.